Hi, welcome back to Pine Meadows Hobby Farm. I'm your host Jerry Hansen. Hey, today I'm looking at all the water resources I have on the uh, farm here at Pine Meadows. Since we've had a really good downpour of rain over the last several days and last night was a torrential amount of rain but no flooding yet. We live in the headwaters of all the tributaries in the area and these mountains here collect all the rain in the, the, the ground has finally soaked up as much moisture as it can and now it's letting some of that rain wash and flow off and fill up the uh, tributaries. So I was trying to gauge which stream would be best suited for a small water wheel to put to augment my electrical generating power system. I may just put a small one up just to experiment with and figure out how to check the flow rate on each stream. Since I have this one coming behind the house, uh, going into the pond and then fl flowing out the spillway, and then I have another one right in front of the house. And that one in front of the house appears to be generating more of a flow than this one. Even though this one has a pond, it has more of a flow on the front stream. I do have another stream up by the driveway, but i that's too far away to think about developing for a little water wheel or something. So. I may just use the spillway here and use the kinetic energy from the water fill flowing down the spillway and put a water wheel right there and let it generate some kind of a force. Uh, it varies with the uh, amount of water I get per season throughout the course of the year. The streams will run for about four months and in the winter time in this part of the season where the days are the shortest is when I need the extra power the most. So I will try to figure out which one works best. My pond here has finally filled up. All of the scum and the uh, and all the algae that floated on the surface has finally drifted out into the uh, spillway and down into the creek. So that's my plans on this stage of figuring out where the water wheel goes. The next uh, step is to figure out a design for a water wheel and then attaching that motor I got from my brother-in-law. So stay tuned for more development and projects here at Pine Meadows Hobby Farm. I'm your host Jerry Hansen. Please subscribe, leave a comment, and look for us on social media. On Pinterest, Facebook, Google Plus, and Twitter. The wind's picking up. <laughs> so, please come again. We'll see you later.